Hello and thank you for tuning in to Unlimited. I'm Walter from Unlimited and this is your WrestleMania 23 throwback review. We kick off the show, Money in the Bank ladder match, Mr. Kennedy versus CM Punk versus Edge versus Finley versus Jeff Hardy versus King Booker versus Randy Orton versus Matt Hardy. Eight-man ladder match. Um, on paper, you would look at that and think, boy, that seems excessive. Turned out great. Um, Jeff Hardy had a match-stealing moment when he went on top of one of those 30-foot ladders and leg-dropped Edge through another ladder, taking them both out of the match. Um, but a lot of other people shined in the match, too. Edge had some great moments before that, um... Orton had some good moments. Matt Hardy had some decent moments. Mr. Kennedy had a pretty great moment when he did the the Lambo leap, the plunge on onto Hornswoggle off the ladder. Um, and Mr. Kennedy ends up winning. Unfortunately, doesn't end up holding onto the briefcase because he thought an injury was worth worse than it was, and he ended up having to drop it to Edge. But it's one of the biggest what-ifs. What if Mr. Kennedy would have kept it? And he would have been the one to cash in on The Undertaker the, that couple months later. What? Where would we be right now? But we'll never know. Then we had the great Kali versus Kane. They tried to recreate Hogan on Great. It didn't work. Next. Chris Benoit versus MVP for the United States title. Excellent match. These two always had excellent matches. Benoit was a huge influence on MVP's career. It's unfortunate this can't be remembered because of the atrocities committed by Chris Benoit on that fateful day just a few months later. But this was a great match Benoit retained. Undertaker versus Batista for the World Heavyweight title. Undertaker wins the Rumble, goes on third, fourth to last. At WrestleMania. It's... I I don't get that. It, it probably should have come main If not main evented. I probably would have main evented it. Um, but Taker Batista for the World Heavyweight title was outstanding. It's one of, if not Batista's best singles match he's ever had. It's one of the best Undertaker streak matches. It has a couple moments where you legitimately think Batista's got it. But, as expected, Taker wins. Wins the World Heavyweight title. Um, great match. Great match. Uh, Rob Van Dam, Sabu, Sandman, and Tommy Dreamer versus Elijah Burke, Kevin Thorne, Marcus Corvon, and Matt Stryker. <sighs> Next. Oh, the ECW is original. The ECW originals one. And now we get to the battle of the billionaires. Bobby Lashley with our current sitting president of the United States. Donald Trump versus Umaga with Armando. Alejandro Estrada and Mr. McMahon. If you were to just watch the hype up for this, you wouldn't know that Bobby Lashley and Umaga exist. It was all based around McMahon and Trump, which it should have been. It should have been. Um, match was... A match. Uh, 
Lashley won. Vince got his head shaved. And Stone Cold Steve Austin can now say he stunned the president. That's about all you got. Ashley Massaro versus Molina, a.k.a. Kevin Dunn's excuse for getting upskirt shots of Ashley. Molina wins, retains the title. Next. John Cena versus Shawn Michaels for the WWE Championship. This might be Cena's best Mania match from an in-ring standpoint. Him and Michaels tore it up for nearly half an hour. They they just put on a damn good match. Cena took a pile driver on the steps, and it ended with big match John. John Cena wins lol, tapping out Shawn Michaels. With his very, very suspect, at best, STF. But yeah, both guys put on great performances in this match. And Cena gets way too much flack for his in-ring work, which some people say is bad. It's not. It's not. And Shawn Michaels is Shawn Michaels. And, yeah, they put on an incredible match. And it would only be topped by their match a few weeks later in London that went an hour. But that's it for WrestleMania 23. Thank you for watching. I've been Walter from Unlimited. Don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe. Join the Facebook group page for Unlimited. Follow us on Twitter at Unlimited1 to keep up to date with all the goings on, see when videos are released, see when podcasts will air, all that. Don't forget to join us for our WrestleMania Predictions podcast. The details will be on the group and on Twitter. Until next time, I will see you all later.